Good morning, children. Today in mathematics, we will be learning all about an abacus. Basically, we will learn how to draw beads and write numbers on an abacus. Now, what is an abacus, children? Abacus is a frame. It's a frame which is either made of wood or plastic. And an abacus has two stands. Let us see, see the stands. This is the first stand and this is the second stand. Now these stands have place values just like numbers have place values. See, we, these stands also have place values. That is ones and t for tens. Now suppose I give you a number and I tell you mark the number on the abacus. I give you a number like 75 and I tell you you have to mark this number on an abacus. So first thing first, you will give these numbers also their place value. Like 5, the place value of 5 will be 1's and the place value of 7 will be 10's. Now we look at the abacus. Under 1's we have 5, so we write 5 over here. And under 10's we have 7, so we write 7 below the 10's tag. Now, Simple. You need to draw the beads. How many beads will you draw children on the stand? Five. Because the digit there is five. So one, two, three, four, and five. Here on the tens stand, the digit given is, you have written this seven. So you can draw seven beads. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And here you got a number and you will write the spelling of 75 for the number name. You see B E N T Y 70 F R B E 5 75. Let's try this with another number. For example, I give you number 1010 and I ask you to mark it on the abacus. First, you will draw an abacus with two stems. Ones and tens. The number here is one zero ten. So let's give them the place two. Zero comes under ones and one comes under tens. Now below ones is zero. So on the stand of ones you can write zero. Below tens is the digit one. So on the stand of tens you can write one. Now when it comes to drawing the beats. Zero means nothing, so you're not going to draw any beads. And one, you will draw one bead. So your number is T E N 10. One zero ten. Similarly, an abacus can also have more stands like ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, and so on. Alright, children? So that's all. Now we will be doing an exercise in your in your maths textbook. That's all in that story, children.